here with Mike Roislin, head coach for UMC Women's Basketball. Huge win over Concordia St. Paul, one of the better teams in the NSIC South. Just talk about that clutch win and those final minutes for you guys. Well, I just I just thought it was a total team effort all the way through tonight, Sean. I think that was the, the defining moment with, with our team, and it was everybody on a different possession, and I thought we just got outstanding effort from everybody. Obviously, down the stretch, we made enough plays, and, and I, I thought we did the job defensively, and really what, what was able to culminate things is I thought we only gave them one shot down the stretch. I thought we had a lot of good looks, and uh, I thought we stayed patient with different things, and we finally got the ball to, to drop when we needed to. I thought everybody came up with a big play, either offensively or, or defensively, at, at at a different moment and I thought the other key thing is that we got good production out of everybody that came in into the game tonight off the bench so between our starters and our bench people it was, it was a great win. Talk about what proved to be the game winning play on an out of bounds play I'm guessing drawn up for Alexa she gets the shot that you know, is her shot. I mean, that's her shot. Yeah, for sure. it is. I mean, and, and it wasn't specifically for her. I thought we had a good. I thought we had a good read that we uh, on the first one, where uh, because of Chris's speed, they're going to have to. They're going to have to really have to honor that. Otherwise, we get that on the first first one. And, and I thought that Alex did a good job of setting it up. She came off it, and I thought Eb made a great pass to her. And obviously, uh, she knocked the shot down. So, you know, uh, just just one of many good shots throughout the game. But that was really a clutch. It was really a clutch shot at that time when we needed it. Huge two wins in a row. Now, how do you take the momentum from the Minot win and then this win going into, you know, three tough games to finish the regular season? Well, I think I think it's fueled by itself right now. I think just this, this, this the momentum with with hanging in there, being resilient enough over over Minot, coming back again this weekend. I think it's, it shows the resiliency that we have. And I think what it's to do is if they can get a good night's rest now and get really get built up, I think it will come into tomorrow night with a lot of momentum. I do think that tomorrow night is going to be a whole different look than, than tonight. So we're going to have to be ready in, in, a, in a real foot race tomorrow night. Okay, thanks, Coach. Here with Alexa Thielman and Sienna Walker, huge win against Concordia St. Paul. First off, if each of you guys want to con comment on just getting that win against a very good Golden Bear team. Yeah. Oh. It always feels good and brings up our confidence. They're a strong team, and we just show that we're just strong with them. Sienna. Yeah, it feels really good. We haven't beaten Concordia for a while, and we're able to stay composed and stay together, so we're really happy. Sienna, you really gave the, boost, uh, the team a boost off the bench tonight. Just t tell us what was kind of working for you today. I mean, I just had to do my best and work hard. If, Shots aren't falling for you or whatever. You can't really control that, but you can always try and just work hard and get those hustle points and those as well. So that's what I try to do. Alexa, tough first half for you, but come out in the second half and get a lot of quick buckets and then the most crucial bucket of the game off an out of bounds play. Just talk about that. What proved to be the game winning shot for you guys tonight? You no, know, during the first half, I was just trying to find my rhythm, and the second half, I finally came, and I guess it just topped it off with the last shot. Just talk about these last two wins, being able to beat two really good teams in Minot and Concordia at the top of the, you know, the conference and on both sides of the, you know, in both divisions. Uh, just talk about what you can take from this going forward into the last three games of the regular season. Um, it's just really good momentum for us. I think it's great to just be moving forward off a couple of wins. And it just makes it a little bit easier in the stretch because we're all really tired and wearing down. So it's good to have a couple of wins. Yeah, it's good to go into the close to the playoffs with gaining some momentum, so it's good for us. Okay, thanks, Earl.